Hello everyone. Welcome back to ProMind classes. Hope you all are doing well. Today, I'm going to recite a very beautiful poetry, Fire and Ice by Robert Frost. Some say the world will end in fire. Some say in ice. From what I have tasted of desire, I hold with those who favor fire. But if it had to perish twice, I think I know enough of hate to say that for destruction eyes. It's also great and would suffice. Robert Frost's poem, Fire and Ice, is a strong symbolic poem where the fire is used as a motion of desire and ice that of hatred. He has used the idea of two groups who have their own possible explanation for the end of the world. One is of the opinion that fire alone can destroy each and every possibility of life on earth, while the other thinks that if ice as a result of extremely low temperature could cover the earth's surface, it would lead to the end of the world. Both the components are compared with self-destructing human emotions desire and hatred. The poet is original of the opinion that he has been very closely associated with the fairy desires and considers it capable of bringing human being on the verge of destruction. Thus, he considers fire as more component for destruction but then he thinks that ice hatred is just a capable of running humans. Though slowly and steadily, therefore, if earth was to an end twice, ice would be just as good as fire. If fire would lead to a rapid destruction, ice could lead to silent damage. Similarly, if the fire is a pure passion, ice is a pure reason. Thus, the poem was artistically underpins the philosophy that we let our emotions rule us and if don't control them, they will surely bring us on all the verge of course. So here, we have completed this beautiful poetry. Hope you like this poem. Hope you like this video. Please do share this video and subscribe our channel. Thanks a lot for the support. Stay tuned with ProMind.